What's going on everyone? Mark here and today we're doing a video on my minimalist kind of bedroom setup. Um, this is all furniture I've ordered through Amazon and it's obviously through different uh, retailers but listed on Amazon and I've got some pros and cons to a little bit of everything but overall most of the furniture is pretty good. Um, I know it's not gonna last forever. I know it's not the most expensive furniture but I figured why not it's a nice kind of more minimal design i don't want anything too crazy i wanted a platform style bed so i feel like this works out best for me let's go ahead and explore all of my furniture also if you want to see kind of some behind the scenes i'll be releasing a video later on of putting together some of the furniture i kind of stopped midway on one of the pieces of furniture the dresser because uh it was really crazy putting together it was steps all over the place and I was not really happy with that one. So anyways, um, let's go ahead and jump to the video and let's get this going. So let's go ahead and start with the bed. This is a platform bed I ordered that's by Baxton Studio. I will have the link for, to it in the description. It's a pretty nice setup. Um, I already had a mattress and everything else, but uh, it's nice having a platform bed. The bed I had before was kind of higher up off the ground. So it's nice to be able to have something lower to the ground. The setup time didn't take really too long, maybe about an hour and a half uh, to two hours. And uh, it came out pretty well. I was surprised by the quality. Some of the reviews were kind of bad on it, but um, I mean, for me, it was a pretty good, easy, straightforward process. And I was able to get the bed assembled pretty quickly. So I left a really good five-star review for the company. The LED strips behind the bed are by Vocolink, and they are really nice entry-level LED strips. For about $30 or less, you can get RGB LED strips that work with HomeKit, and those are really awesome. So I've actually got two sets of those. I've got one underneath the bed and then one behind the headboard. These nightstands are by Modway. They are a mid-century modern end table, which I will have those in the description as well. The two lamps are by Elegant Designs, and I really like them because they also kind of throw in this minimalistic design. This Baxton Studio dresser, um, I've got some mixed emotions on it, actually. Uh, I mean, it looks better now that it's together, but it's still not perfect. The lines didn't line up all correctly. And overall, the build was just kind of all over the place. The directions were never really consistent. So you'd start building one part of the dresser and then you'd flip over to a complete different part. And then you would never come back to the other part till like 10 steps later. And so uh, I was not really happy with that. Uh, but other than that, it came out pretty well and there's a few blemishes on it. Um, the rest of the furniture I got did not have any blemishes on it, but this one did not uh, come here flawless, I guess. So uh, that's one thing that kind of also is a down on it. But other than that, it's a pretty nice set and it complements the rest of the setup. Thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and also hit the bell button. And feel free to check me out on TikTok. I have my information down below. Thank you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.